Hello, my name is Mary Hamilton, a local Braidwood artist and potter. If you are passionate about your community, arts and activism, and our Indigenous history and culture, please listen in. In my small heritage listed town of Braidwood, nestled in the southern tablelands of New South Wales, we are planning a unique and special festival. Called the Two Fires Festival of Arts and Activism, it celebrates the legacy of poet and activist Judith Wright, who spent the last decades of her life amongst us here in Braidwood. May this year marks the 100th anniversary of Judith's birth. This year's festival will be held from the 15th to the 17th of May to acknowledge this. The two fires represent Judith's two activist passions, the environment and Indigenous rights. She was way ahead of her time in recognising threats to our precious land, many of which remain today. She was way ahead of her time in recognising huge and fundamental injustices experienced by the first people of this country, many of which remain today. Our Indigenous mentor, while Bunja Elder, Uncle Max Dalamunmun Harrison, speaks of the two fires as representing old and new, past and present, and arts and activism. Held every two years since 2005, this is the only festival in Australia that combines art and activism. Many passionate artists, musicians, dancers, poets, writers and intellectuals will attend the festival, share knowledge, ideas, aspirations in a friendly and welcoming atmosphere. We will have poetry sessions, environmental events and activities to engage and excite all ages. We will learn dances from our Indigenous friends, watch inspiring film and be entertained by accomplished musicians and performers. Our festival theme this year is Nura Nabu, local Dariga language for all cultures, all people, all land. A key event of the festival will be the unveiling of the Dariga Rock, an extraordinarily beautiful work of public art, acknowledging the people who occupied and cared for this land for tens of thousands of years before the town of Braidwood was established. This is an act of healing and of education. It is a local initiative and yet it speaks to issues across this country. The rock will be unveiled in the town park with due ceremony and celebration. We believe this festival can make a difference. As with most community arts, funding has become much more of a challenge. Grants previously received are no longer available but this will not deter us with your help. The festival is run entirely by volunteers with no paid staff. All of your contributions will go directly to artists, performers and speakers. Please join us by contributing as you are able and do come to the Two Fires Festival in May 